Hi friends, uh, in this video we will discuss about the surface adsorption. So, uh, for, a, for an example purpose I have uh, taken this L bend. So, I will just uh, show it on the screen. So, now uh, if you consider uh, here, so this would be the inlet. Sorry. So, this would be the inlet and this would be the outlet uh, from inlet N2 with a mass fraction of 0.7 would enter and O2 with a mass fraction of 0.3 would enter and this part is a wall where we kept uh, some material so we kept some material which can absorb which can absorb N2 so here in this part n2 would be adsorbed so the mass fraction of n2 need to reduce here right and exactly in ansys fluent there is no such option of uh, adsorbing the species particular uh, species out of uh, these two or out of any three or of four so i have written some udf in order to uh, adsorb the n2 near the wall such that remaining fraction would will be going along with the flow so i'll just show you the udf so this is your udf so i have uh, created a remove into option with the volume into as my uh, variables and i uh, have created a domain and with domain i have created a lookup thread so with respect to the thread i have accessed the cell uh, variables or cells which are just adjacent to the wall where the adsorption will take place so the cells which are adjacent to wall i have given this uh, thing what you can see on the screen where uh, the volume fraction or sorry species uh, mass fraction uh, with zero as an index so that is the nitrogen because zero is the first species that is the nitrogen and in that cells the species fraction need to uh, been subtracted with 0 0.4 so it does mean that nitrogen and in those cells uh, with the fraction if for example if the fraction is uh, around 0 0.5 so those cells now would be 0 0.5 minus 0 0.4 0 0.1 so the cells what we can observe here just adjacent cells so the adjacent cells volume fraction if it is present as 0 0.5 it will be turned into 0 0.1 so that is the representation or indication of this udf what exactly will that will takes place so this udf i have written and i'll just uh, try and go to functions interpret it and uh, browse a particular udf what i want to uh, interpret so i've written it on this uh, desktop so this is the udf with name extension dot c just interpret it so after interpretation uh, you need to hook the two adjust function what you can see in function hooks so close this go to function hooks so already i have uh, hooked it so it is been automatically showing it so this is the udf name so click on ok then ok so the udf would be hooked and then uh, procedure is same just go to multi models energy on uh, viscous acidic omega in the species fraction just on the species tick mark apply ok and uh, i have uh, been to materials the mixer tab so click on the materials so after clicking on the materials you will get that mixer tab so in the mixer tab uh, template i have kept only nitrogen and oxygen and remaining everything have removed it so you can use the edit button and use this in order to keep nitrogen and oxygen so nitrogen should be first because it is a species index zero what we have used in udf so after that change click on change and create so that uh, the save uh, settings or the changes what you have done would be saved close it in the boundary condition as i said inlet so inlet should have a uh, species mass fraction of nitrogen as 0 0.7 and oxygen as 0 0.3 so go to species and to s 0.7 and have given some velocity of 0.1 meter per second so this is so random uh, for only example purpose i have considered these things so outlet pressure uh, so it would be zero pressure which is uh, gauge zero means it is open to atmosphere uh, and the wall 
it is the wall stuck so wall stuck means it is this wall so i'll just show it in your mess what exactly that wall stuck represents so just uh, i will hide all these things and i'll keep only wall stuck maybe outlet would also be helpful for displaying so this is outlet and this you can see that is wall stuck so that wall stuck id is uh, 6 so that 6 i have used in this udf so you can see this is the domain i with the thread id 6 so after that uh, just go to initialize uh, initialize it then click on run calculation calculate So after running through few iterations, uh, I just selected this uh, species and mass fraction of N2. So click on compute and uh, display. So you can see on the screen here the entry is a mass fraction of 0.7. When it is coming here, you can see it has been reduced. So it is very near to uh, zero because we have uh, removing uh, 0.4 of the fraction. So these cells would have a very negligible uh, nitrogen fraction. Remaining would be only oxygen fraction present here, and it remaining would be uh, going out of the outlet. So this is in a uh, it's shown clearly here. Maybe we can just go to the reports and check whether the mass fraction has been changing or not. So go to surface integral. Uh, so inlet nitrogen fraction uh, we'll check. It is 0.7. It's okay. We are given that, and outlet. Uh, so you can see there is a reduction in mass fraction because it has been consumed here. So if this is a mass fraction that has been reduced, it should proportionately increase in oxygen. So we will check in the oxygen whether it is increased or not. So increased. So you can see oxygen is 0 0.3 at the inlet, but at the outlet is 0 0.3046. So the oxygen mass fraction has been increased. So here the nitrogen has been adsorbed and the oxygen content is being increased. So these kind of principles would be used in uh, 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 processes where oxygen requirement is there in order to adsorb completely nitrogen in oxygen cylinder fillings and all those things. So we can use this uh, procedure for simulating. Uh, hope you guys uh, had enjoyed this video and had gained knowledge how to simulate the adsorption of uh, any species onto walls. So uh, please do subscribe the channel, share the channel among your groups and encourage me uh, in doing more number of videos. If you have any questions or queries, uh, please post in the comment section.